So in this particular slide, we are talking about the aviatrix components, main components of aviatrix that we have. So basically first is aviatrix controller that is used for configuration management, main brain behind the aviatrix platform, right? Any configuration that you do happens through aviatrix controller. Second is aviatrix gateways that are deployed in spoke and transit VPCs for the communication part. Third is cloud networking abstraction. So that uh, architecture remains uh, same throughout the complete uh, different different cloud platforms. Fourth is Aviatrix uh, Copilot that is used for day to troubleshooting, day to visibility and operational support. Then the main 10 points that we want to discuss through the Aviatrix architecture would be that it is available in single cloud. It can be in multi-region, second point. Third point is multi-cloud repeatable design. That means the architecture that we follow in a single cloud remains the same throughout the different different clouds. Fourth is high performance encryption. That means we run high performance encryption from spoke with our gateway to the transit gateway and from transit towards the on-prem locations to our cloud and devices. Then we talk about segmentation, which means if we want to have network isolation between different different uh, VPCs, like prod cannot talk to shared, cannot talk to dev, that is possible through the segmentation feature of Aviatrix. Then service insertion and chaining, if you want to deploy a firewall, if you want to deploy any uh, device through which you want to have service uh, chaining enabled, like F5 or Palo Alto, these kind of devices, if you want to insert, that is possible. Seventh is for day two operations and visibility, threat analytics, troubleshooting, we have Copilot available. Eighth is secure cloud access. That means if you want to apply something called like RBAC or you want to still apply something like segmentation, that is also possible. Ninth is secure ingress and egress. We can deploy firewalls for east-west inspection or north south in inspection. If you, if you want to have traffic move towards internet, that is also possible through the firewall. Then cloud native, if you still want to uh, use some of the cloud native constructs like TGW, we can do TGW orchestration as well. Some of the use cases that we see can be leveraged out of Aviatrix would be egress FQDN filtering, overlapping IP CIDR, secure user access, FireNet, multi-cloud transit means multi-cloud uh, repeatability, and then HPE. Thank you.